In Cumbria, well, in one town in Cumbria at least, are furious after plans were made to use eight homes to house 40 asylum seekers. Well, currently the town is suffering from a housing shortage, which has led to the backlash. Yeah, this town is Millam, actually, in the South Lakes. Last night, Patrick Christie's spoke to the mayor of Millam, Simone Faulkner, about this issue. We are fighting back. Um, we went to our MP, Trudy Harrison, who has gone to the government at Serco Home Office uh, to have meetings. Um, Millam is, is a very small, isolated town. Um, our infrastructure is poor, transport is poor. Um, but what I think has created this um, uh, high tension is that the community were not consulted by anybody. We just did not know this was going to happen until the workers came in started working on the properties, uh, a Cumbrian, a, a Millamite asked the person, well, what are you doing there? And they said, well, well, this is for HMOs. And then that got onto social media. And we, the town council, knew nothing about this until it actually appeared on social media. Well, we've not been given any information. We don't know. We've been told that there'll be wraparound support for apparently asylum seekers, but we still haven't been told in what way. There's been no strategy that's been given to us, no plans. Um, I mean, Millam is a very compassionate town. We housed Ukrainian refugees quite happily, no issue. But because we've not been given any information at all, we just don't know what's going to happen and how it's going to happen. I know there's going to be support, but we've not been given that information. But proper um, strategies, proper plans and consultation m might not have resulted in this reaction. You know, it's the lack of information that, that has created this, I think. And I have to say thank you to the police force in the, in the local town because they have been working around the clock to try and keep things quiet. Well, we're, we are now waiting to hear what, if anything, our MP has been able to achieve. And then we'll have to go from there and, and decide what actions we may take as a town. But they have to be peaceful. You know, the, the vandalism, the graffiti, I've never known it. I've been here 22 years. It's never happened before. Yes, there is a genuine concern. We are, we are lacking in social housing. So the question is, um, Serco has put these properties, some of these properties Archi they've archived them and um, I'm asking can can they kind of let them out to the local residents to rent if they're archived why not it's a valid question mm. it's a valid question it's interesting that the mayor of Millam there saying this wouldn't have been a huge problem necessarily or certainly not had the backlash that it's had now if there'd been information provided. Yeah. And that's the key. People need to know what's going on.